How to transfer Solana from Coinbase to Phantom Wallet. Hey guys, welcome to this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how we can send our Solana. So first of all, we need to have two applications opened. The first one might be the Coinbase app. And the second one is going to be an extension from our browser called the Phantom. So that's the reason we can make the transaction a bit more easier. Now, if you don't have your Phantom application as an extension in your browser, what I strongly recommend you is to add it just by tapping into phantom.app. Now, once we are in here, just select the download. And if you are with it on your phone, select this just select one of those out options or if you're on a desktop like I am just select your favorite browser and in my case I select Chrome and we're ready to go now that we have our phantom wallet ready what you guys want to do is to look for the Solana token if you don't see it no problem you just need to click where it says deposit and go and select for Solana that would be S O L and after that we select the Solana token and this information we needed that so we want to copy this information and let's go back into our Coinbase now what you guys want to do is to look for the Solana token which in this case I want to go where it says trade so I'm gonna select Sol. this is a way that we can trade for my token in this case I have the Bitcoin so I want to send Bitcoin to Solana but if you already have Solana within your Coinbase then what you want to do is to select the one that says send and receive now that we select this information you you're gonna see a pop-up like this and let's select the one that says pay with and I'm going to select my crypto in this case that would be Solana now it says that due to degraded performance on the external uh, may fail at elevated rates if your transaction fails please try again sometimes this happens a lot within the network uh, of Solana because there are a few amount of transactions every single day so sometimes it takes a little bit more time to make the transaction so just be aware of that then you select how many Solanas you want to send into your Phantom wallet and in here what we want to do is to paste the address that we just uh, retrieved from our Phantom wallet and if you want to put a note that's up to you guys in this case I can put one two three four and just hit end to continue now, after you receive a confirmation on your email, you, you can also receive a confirmation from the Phantom Wallet. And if you go into your Phantom Wallet, you're going to see that in the recent transactions that you receive Solana inside your Phantom Wallet. So if I select Solana, I'm going to see all the transactions that have been done through the, light, through the latest months and all that. So, so you should see your transactions in here. Even if the transaction was not successful, you're going to see it in the transaction history inside Phantom Wallet. So there you have it guys, it wasn't that hard. Hopefully this was very useful for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more about this app. Thank you for watching the video and I'll be seeing you guys on the next one.